Hi, welcome back to Swiss Family Fun. I'm Tanya and today our family is in Gestad in the Berner Oberland. We are on our summer holidays and we're spending three days in this area. It is so beautiful. We haven't been here for about 10 years so it's nice to explore. All right, so today we have ridden up to Rinderberg and we're doing a ridge hike, pretty short, only about six kilometers over to Hornley Egg. And then we ride the cable car or the gondola back down and take the train back. So we're just doing kind of a little sampler here. Panorama, as you can see around me, it's so beautiful. Just get an overview of this area. I will put a link in the description below to our website where I have all the details for this hike, including a trail map. Uh, if you are planning a trip to Switzerland, I also have an ebook, free ebook, that has 20 top 10 lists for all sorts of hikes here in Switzerland waterfalls, ridges, suspension bridge, alpine coasters, yeah, all the fun stuff stuff. Uh, if you haven't subscribed to our channel yet, please do and support us. And now let's get on the trail. We're gonna hike up there and then we're gonna hike around, 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 around over to that cable car and ride that down. That's Shin Reed over there. Beautiful region. Pretty relaxed, I guess, these cows. Oh, sudden movements, cows. This isn't a particularly hard hike, but it does have stairs and lots of loose rock and things to walk over, so you need sure footing, but it's not dangerous or that difficult. We live on the eastern side of Switzerland in Zurich, and so normally where we're hiking, we say Grüzi, which is just hello, but when you go into the Berner Oberland, you say Grüsse instead of Grüzi, and then we're basically in the French part almost, so most of the people here are saying bonjour. I don't really know what to say to people on the trail. And if you're German, you say hallo, not grootsy. It's funny. Sleepy cows. <laughs> just this morning, we were just about over there, Hannemus, and then we drove all the way around these mountains to come here. A little barn where they make cheese. We got our actually Alpenkäse. What do they got here? Everyone's got a refreshing drink from the caves that I. We could pay with Twint, so convenient. How beautiful this is. <laughs> it looks like I don't really want to be crammed in with all these people. But Our last uphill. Whew. It's a little warm today. Yesterday I was wearing gloves and two jackets. Here the trail splits. That one goes more flat to the to the gondola and this one goes up to a peak. Hope I made the right decision. We're hiking up to Horn Flu. You want me to go through? Okay. Careful, this one's barbed wire. Up on the tough trail. Well, not that tough. Just makes it a little bit more interesting. Oh, nice. All these little signs for the flowers. Ooh, nice stone steps. So we came up to this little detour to Hornflu, to this little peak right before we go down the mountain. I think it was worth it, I really liked it, but it is definitely steep and much harder coming down. So if that's not for you, it's fine. Just take the other trail over to the gondola and over at uh, Horn Egli and you're fine. But I thought this was nice. I like this part, it's kind of fun. All the good wildflowers are here. Cows can't be up here to eat them. Look at this. 
This is a long, steep way down. I'm actually happy to see these stairs because before it was slippery on the rocks. Very difficult, but I think it's beautiful. Look at all these purple flowers right here. I love it so much. Look at that. There's a little picnic area for Stella. Written down from Horn Egli to Schönried. Now we're gonna catch the train back to where we parked at Runderberg. It's been a great hike, really like it. If you wanna do this hike, I will put a link in the description below to our website where I have all the details, including a trail map, and we'll see you here next time for more family fun in Switzerland. <laughs>